Hey everyone, it's Rob here representing the One Shot channel. And today, I'm gonna to be taking a look at the brand new Huawei Mate XS, which I've got right here. And I've also got with me today the Huawei Mate X, which was released in 2019. On the surface, these two products look pretty similar, but let's not judge a book by its cover. So let's dive in and check these two devices out. Now naturally with a foldable smartphone, the most mind blowing part of this experience is going to be the foldable display. And I'm holding this in my hand right now and I can literally not believe it. I am bending this product without any issue at all. It is really nice. And the screen is still intact and functional. I've always liked Huawei's innovative folding designs. The Mate XS packs its cameras, USB-C type port, fingerprint scanner which doubles as the power button and a load of other components into this sidebar, which locks the secondary screen into place when folding. When we unfold the phone, the sidebar can serve as a handle, with just the right amount of curve for me to hold it firmly and naturally. Now because the cameras and light sensors are not on the screen, the Huawei Mate XS is truly bezel free, without any sort of notch it has a falcon wing hinge, so I can genuinely fold it anywhere between 0 and 180 degrees. It's 5.4 millimeters thick at its thinnest when it's opened up in the 8 inch tablet mode and 11 millimeters thick when folded. When using the 6.6 .6 inch primary display, it has a really comfortable grip. It acts and looks and feels just like a regular smartphone. This improved mechanical hinge is crafted from zirconium based liquid metal, which is 130% harder than titanium alloy. Now the rotating shaft on the Huawei Mate XS is more sturdy and more durable compared to the previous generation, which should make it much nicer and, and give you a little bit of peace of mind in case you accidentally drop it on the edge. Unlike the Mate X, the hinge on the Mate XS has an oval shape, which creates a tighter seal. Now the Huawei Mate XS features an aerospace grade optical polyamide, which according to Huawei is more expensive than gold. Now two layers of this aerospace grade optical polyamide technology or film is actually stuck together with crystal clear adhesive. This means for consumers that the display is not only crystal clear, but it is also incredibly resilient. It already comes with a protective film already attached to help it withstand everyday wear and tear. Now in some of my previous videos, I've talked about the various different types of foldable smartphones. And the really big question I think for a lot of consumers is, do I really need a foldable smartphone? And what's the reason I should buy a foldable smartphone? Is it just because it looks cool? Just think about the Samsung Galaxy Z Flip and the Motorola Razr, which can be flipped and folded. But when unfolded, they look just like the standard screen on an unfoldable phone. And if we look at the Galaxy Fold, its 4.6 inch phone mode serves no practical purpose. We can't really use it as a regular phone, but instead have to unfold it into tablet mode for just about everything. As I said in my previous videos, and I still believe it, Huawei's outfolding approach to the foldable smartphone design is actually really impressive. And I think it's more useful for a lot of consumers who are looking for a larger screen device. You know, a lot of people say the bigger the display, the better the experience, providing the product isn't too bulky and it still can be used in one hand. The Mate XS gives me a good sized 6.6 inch display. So even when folded, it still functions like a traditional smartphone. Then I can open it up and go into tablet mode, which has a huge 8 inch display. In this mode, I can use new features like multi-window and multi-screen collaboration. So it feels just like I'm using a real tablet. To get the most out of all this screen space, we can run two applications side by side in a split view, like on the Huawei Mate X. Also with the Huawei Mate X's new EMUI 10 operating system, we can swipe in from either side of the display and hold to access an edge dock panel, and then have a third app floating on top which we can move around freely. So with the Huawei Mate XS, we can multitask with up to three apps. On such a big screen, it doesn't look cluttered at all. The interaction between apps is really seamless. We can instantly drag and drop text and images from one app to another. This means I can do some shopping when I'm watching a video and show my partner what I'm thinking of buying or without switching between screens or apps. 
Now the Huawei Mate XS also features unrivaled performance as well as other amazing advancements in camera and other aspects of the technology including its battery life as well. The Huawei Mate XS is powered by the Huawei Kirin 990 5G chipset which is streets ahead of the previous generation Huawei Kirin 980 chipset that uses a separated Barlong 5000 modem to access and enjoy 5G speeds. With the Huawei Kirin 995G chipset, the Huawei Mate XS delivers advancements in CPU, GPU and MPU performance as well as delivering better overall battery efficiency. The Huawei Mate XS also features more antennas inside the product, allowing this product to access 8 different 5G frequencies globally, which is double that available in the Huawei Mate X launched last year. Not only that, but it delivers a better holistic 5G connectivity experience, which is perfect for those that love to travel and want to connect to different 5G experiences around the world. It has four cameras, a 40 megapixel ultra photosensitive main camera on the top, an eight megapixel telephoto lens directly underneath, a 16 megapixel ultra wide angle lens, and a 3D time of flight depth sensor on the bottom. Because of the huge display on the Huawei Mate XS, shooting videos and capturing amazing photos is absolutely phenomenal. The outward folding design means that there isn't a front camera. The rear camera on the back of the device handles absolutely everything. I just need to point the cameras this way. And there we go, a super high definition selfie and video calls. All sorts of super cool features can now be used when taking selfies. Too, like slow motion selfie videos. When the phone is folded, my subject will be able to see how they are looking in the secondary display, so they can change their pose or expression if they need to. The battery capacity of the Huawei Mate XS is also impressive, which you'd expect from Huawei's innovative smartphone technologies. In fact, the battery inside the Huawei Mate XS has a total capacity of 4,500 milliamps. And even in those moments when you're running out of power, don't worry. The proprietary 55 watt supercharge boosts it back up to 85% in just 30 minutes. The cooling system was apparently inspired by the flying fish and the way it extends its fins as it glides through the air. The Mate XS spreads any heat it generates across the entirety of its body, so it always stays super cool. The Huawei Mate XS has improved a lot compared to the Huawei Mate X launched in 2019, and it's safe to say that the Huawei Mate XS is another example of a top-notch 5G foldable smartphone or a folding tablet if you'd prefer. Now the price of the Huawei Mate XS is approximately 2,499 euros and I'm pretty sure that a lot of developers are scrambling some way to find out whether they can adapt their application to the incredibly beautiful and large size display available on the Huawei Mate XS. I should also note that this is a Huawei product launching in 2020, which means no Google. Out of the box, this product won't come pre-installed with applications like Gmail, Google Maps, and most importantly, the Google Play Store, which is where you would have downloaded applications onto a Huawei device in the past. Instead, Huawei will launch this product with the Huawei App Gallery. Now, this is the App Gallery experience that is growing incredibly fast with a range of different developers wanting to work with Huawei. And let's hope that we're going to see more applications available in the App Gallery shortly. In fact, there are already a dedicated environment or section within the app gallery that supports foldable smartphones. We can't wait to experience what applications are available on this device. So that's it for my review of the Huawei Mate XS. Can't wait to see you next time. Bye-bye.